to the next section. Yeah, let's talk about Microsoft embracing repairable Xbox controllers. Oh, cool. Yeah, they sell replacement parts for Xbox controllers. They have posted step-by-step repair guides, and the parts include PCBAs. That must just be PCBs. That's got to be, what's a PCBA? PCB assembly. Oh, that must be it. Uh, Buttons, top cases, and motor assemblies with attached rumble motors. This is, I mean, on the surface, at least Microsoft following through with a promise to explore helping customers repair their own hardware from 2021. When they promised to explore it, I basically went, ugh. We're never going to see anything from this because, I mean... It's just explore. In our defense, we had just come off opening up some Surface laptop or something or tablet. I forget exactly what it was. But it was like... Very poor repairability. It was like 1 out of 10 repairability <laughs> score for my fix that we could barely figure out how to get the stupid thing open. Um, and here it is. Okay, they actually did... I, I mean... There's still a lot of things that they could do in their designs to make them more repairable by their nature... But this is something. Oh, that's great. Our next uh, talking point says, many Microsoft products are still compromised by past design decisions. Yeah, exactly. Uh, Two months ago, for example, hardware technician The Coder criticized Microsoft for the design of the SSDs in their Xbox Series consoles, which are encrypted in a way that makes them impossible to replace independently. It's like, we harp on Apple for this stuff, so we're certainly not going to let it slide when Microsoft does it. That sucks. And it doesn't need to be done. With the kind of R&D budget, man, the Apple SSD thing was even, like, actually deeper than I thought. I linked a really great forum post under the um, starting at is is the biggest lie in tech. There's a really great post on the forum that goes into how very different Apple's SSD architecture is. Pretty much all of it is completely unnecessary. Like, literally completely unnecessary but overcomplicates it and makes it proprietary because why use a wheel that exists when you can reinvent the crap out of your own and make it the wheelest wheel <laughs> that is different from the other wheels? Um, this one's got spokes. If the amount of resources that companies like Apple and Microsoft dedicate to making their devices less repairable instead went to making them more repairable, how much better of a place would the world be? Uh, Plug in PlayStation says, wasn't this just in a Game Linked video? Yes. The WAN show is late news from white guys with beards. <laughs> it's not even really news. I mean, it's right in the name, new. It's not new. Yeah. The WAN show has always been, always been like that. <clears throat> but yeah, I mean, uh, they're probably right to trash on them for certain things, but they did a cool thing. Thank you. It's good. 